Hey guys, it's me again, but if you don't know me, my name is Rachel. If you guys can't tell, I have laryngitis, but life must go on. Because I've had laryngitis for a week, and this package has been at my house for a whole week, and I've been wanting to open it so bad. This video is sponsored by Lucan. They sent me a bunch of Korean clothes to try on in style for you guys, and I'm so excited. This has been sitting at my house for so long. So all this stuff comes directly from Korea, and the shipping was actually really fast too. I'm really sad that it came like right when I got my laryngitis though, because I've been wanting to film this video for so long. It took about like one to two weeks, and it came from DHL Express. First look. <laughs> look at. I got a lot of cute like fall and winter pieces and the shipping is also worldwide so if you live in like Canada like my friend Bree then you can get this stuff too. They've also got an app as well. I'll link it down below and I'll link everything that I have in this video down below as well. All of this stuff is authentic Korean fashion. It comes straight from Seoul. Is that not the coolest thing ever? I'm so sorry for my voice, but I, I'm leaving soon to go on a trip and I have to film this video, so what can you do? And today I'm going to focus on styling all of these pieces. I don't even know what to do first at this point. I kind of forgot what I ordered too. Lucan's strength is actually styling. If you take a look at their website, they're all impeccably styled. Just saying. I am so excited to style all this stuff. I even got a few accessories too. I've been wanting to get into scarves recently. Alright, here we go. Especially since I haven't gone out all week, bro. I'm so excited to wear clothes. <laughs> okay, let's see. What should I do first? Let's start easy first. We're gonna start off with this. All of this stuff, guess what, is in either black, white, gray, or blue. So, <laughs> we're gonna have to try to add color. I have this cable knit dress. It's so cute. I've been into cable knit recently, and also I kind of want to wear more dresses. So, here's the dress. Also guys, do you like my my shirt? It's November, so that means it's automatically Christmas. <laughs> it's like this really cute flared dress. Here, I'll put it on. All right, here's the dress on. It's a little bit lower than I expected, but that's okay. It's so cute. I really like the puff sleeves and the way that like the dress flares out. Look at the detail of the cable knit. Like, cable knit sleigh. It's so Christmassy. Or like wintry. Okay, I feel like I need to add. I have a white turtleneck somewhere, but my sister stole it from me, so I can't wear it. I guess that's how we're starting that this video out. We're just gonna <laughs> figure it out, I guess. So I'm thinking either these white ones or these black ones. We're gonna do the black ones, and we're gonna add some fun socks to make this more interesting. I've got these ones. I got these socks from Garage, but they have like a little black but it's got black on the top and I think it will match if I do these shoes. How are you guys doing? I bet you're doing better than me because laryngitis sucks. <laughs> I feel like I need something like around my neck for sure. Okay, so I've been seeing a lot of girls like tying like ribbons around their neck. I don't think this one's long enough though. Actually, I've never actually tried this before. I wish Okay, I wish this was longer for sure. It's a bit short, but that's okay. I think we need to add a bag. Yeah, this is my favorite classic bag. It's kind of like, it looks kind of like leather, but it's not. Kind of simple. It's a good first outfit. It's like quite simple and cute and like casual. I definitely want to buy some more ribbons so I can make this longer because it'd be so cute. But like, I feel so cute. So this is obviously from Lucan. I got this from my craft room. This is thrifted. This is from Garage, and then these, which is my Doc Martens, that I got at the Facebook Marketplace. Wait! Guys, before I go, I could add a hat. I have a beret. Do I know how to wear berets? <laughs> no, I don't. But this outfit, I feel like would look cute with a beret. See, I can't really tell if this is a sleigh. <laughs> I can't tell if this is a sleigh or not. <laughs> like, <laughs> I don't know. <laughs> Actually, I, it's kind of cute. I think it's cute, guys. What do you think? With or without beret, please comment down below. I need to know. Um, so cute. The beret is from Yes Style. <laughs> Alright, next. 
next thing, we're gonna do something more grungy now. We're gonna do this. Y'all know I love this, right? So, I've been trying to thrift one of these, but I can only find like huge men's sizes, and I want one that's like kind of like smaller, more tight fitting. So I got this one. Let's just pair it with like a classic button up shirt. So I actually paired it not with a white button down, just with like, like a white long sleeve. And I put it with this mini skirt that I cut to make it shorter. <laughs> and also guys, if you can see this, it has like a cute little thing where it cinches the back to make it like, you know, our guys. <laughs> I'm gonna switch shoes, but this could be an outfit. But I just got some new shoes. I've been wanting these so bad, guys. They are the Princess Polly, like, dupes for the Buffalo London shoes. Like, look at how cute they are. And they make me so tall, guys. That's the, the prime reason why I bought them. If you, can't, if you can't tell, I'm only five feet tall. And I feel like these would look really good with some, like, leg warmers. Also, guys, I've been into the whole, like, white tie thing. I know everybody wears, like, black ties because that's more classic. But, like, white ties. White ties slay. And these shoes are so cute. Were they expensive? Yeah, but they were not ex as expensive as the Buffalo London ones. I was not about to drop $300 on a pair of shoes. I actually kind of like how, like, the leg warmers aren't, like, pure white. Because it kind of gives contrast. And the fact that this is leather, because it, like, gives a different, um, what is it called? It's, like, a different material, so it's, like, shiny. So it doesn't, like, blend in too much with, like, the skirt. This is my white tie. I actually don't even... Uh, uh, we're ditching the tie, just kidding. The tie was not the move. By the way, I would be wearing all of these outfits with like fleece line tights, but I'm too lazy to put them on and I don't have any skin colored ones. Let me know if you guys know of any good fleece line tights because I feel like the color of them compared to my legs might be a little too light because I have like, I have like darker skin and I'm scared that it's not gonna be like the right shade and will look silly. Okay, I think the necklace helps. It's kind of like adding some contrast up here. And then for bag, I don't know. I could add the bag as a pop of color, even though it's not really, it's not really color, it's tan, which is not really a color, but I think it would kind of like break up the whole like black and white thing. Okay, so shoes, Princess Polly, Yes Style, Aritzia, obviously Lucan, garage this is from a depop seller and then this is thrifted but it's kipling i added all these cute little pins on it look like look how cute the pins are this one this one says it says if you want to know someone find out what makes them angry i don't know why that was so funny to me but it just made me laugh <laughs> yeah here's the final look i can also add like a jacket but i think that would ruin it so i'm not going to actually I'm gonna, okay, I'm gonna style this jacket separately, but I do have a jacket that I feel like would match this outfit too, so we're gonna have a bonus two outfits. We're just gonna try it on and see. I'll style this one next, okay? But it's this leather. I don't know if it's real or not. And I feel like the cream color would match with like the leg warmers. Like, tell me I'm wrong. I got it in a small. <laughs> Stop, it cuts off at the right place too. <laughs> like, bye. This silhouette, the way this perfectly fits my silhouette. I, huh. oh my gosh. Never have I ever found a jacket that is like cropped at the right place. Cause I have such a short torso, it's so embarrassing. Like, how cute it is. Okay, I'm gonna take it off for like the trial portion now. Like the little video with the songs. But yeah, that's this outfit. Alright, now we're actually gonna style the jacket. This is definitely a jeans moment. I haven't worn jeans in so long. It's been too hot here in Washington, which is surprising actually. I'm gonna do these blue jeans. They're just like these flared ones that I've worn in a ton of videos. Okay, so I feel like this outfit calls for a baseball hat. I don't know. I feel like that feels like, that feels right. Maybe a tie. Maybe we'll try the white tie. Actually, no, we're not going to. I think I'm gonna do this one. 
Not really sure what direction this is going to go. I can't add any more colors. I've already added too many colors. This is a very important and difficult decision to make. I'm already decision fatigued and I've only been filming for like 15 minutes. <laughs> the thing about this jacket is that the top part is a cream color. So if I wear like white with it, it's it might be a little interesting. Like not in a bad way, but it could be in a bad way. <laughs> Oh, I hate this. I like how it's like... <laughs> you know what, I feel like the vibe is... Let's close the jacket. <laughs> that is the vibe. We're gonna do this with these white platform docks. Pull my hair in a claw clip. Maybe that will be the move instead of the hat. Oh yeah, that worked, that fixed it a little bit. <laughs> I have the perfect bag for this book as well. It's this tote bag. Oh yeah, it's late. I feel like the bag pulls us all together. Cause like without it, it'd be kind of plain. But like with the bag, the bag is pulling it through. These pants are thrifted. These are Doc Martens. I got it from the store. Lucan shirt, garage from the last outfit. This is from the Hard Rock Cafe store in Florida. I got it in my Florida vlog if you want to watch that. I feel like a cool, like, male. You know how boys wear the motor jackets and they're like, with their tote bags and they're just like... <laughs> this is the final fit, number three. never been done before. So we've got this skirt. I hope this fits. It's a mini skirt, but most of the time mini skirts aren't actually mini on me, you know? This is pretty mini. It's just a denim mini skirt. So cute. Just like a little classic. And then, I don't really wear things that are like off the shoulder, but I saw that this came with like a little scarf. So we're gonna see. I hope this looks good on me <laughs> guys this is actually perfect the thing that i love about korean fashion is because everything fits me because i'm short and i'm also a size small because look at how perfect this skirt is it has shorts underneath it and then i think for the scarf you put it like like this way and then you go like this also i've never really tried out things that are off the shoulder because most of the time they're too like loose and it like goes down but this shirt is like tight but not too tight that like the sleeves like what is this sorcery like huh i don't know what they did to this top to make it like this but i love it it's amazing i look so minimalistic so like effortlessly cool goodbye this is literally the best haul of my life so excited to go outside again and wear my cute little outfits. I feel like this calls for hair down. Hair pigtails, except I don't really wanna put my hair up. But imagine pigtail hair, that'd be really cute. For shoes, we're gonna do my classic Converse just cause this is kind of like a classic look. I love that this skirt has shorts because I'd wear shorts with it anyway, but the fact that it has built-in shorts, oh, God bless. I feel so cute and cool and like fancy but like not fancy because it's like simple ah i feel so cool what if i tied this in a bow that's not what they did on the website but i don't care we're gonna try it that's cute too thoughts bow or scarf i actually think scarf is better but <laughs> i'm glad we tried it or if i did it with a tie too but like skinny scarves are coming back but like Soleil. <laughs> Here's off a four. So we've got this scarf. I've been kind of wanting to get into scarves. So I have this striped one. I feel like that could go with this outfit too to make it pop a little more. And then I have these arm warmers. And then last, I have this crop sweater. I've been trying to get into more cropped things because I normally buy things that are like way too big for me because I like how it overwhelms my frame. 
but I wanted to try something new. So today we have a cable knit sweater. Here's the sweater on. I have a white button down under it, obviously. <laughs> if you can't see it. I think the model on the website styled it like this with this like skirt, except they had like a cropped shirt. I feel like that would be cool, but I'm not about to just cut this, so I'm gonna put on some jeans. Cause I don't think this like look would look, I feel like this wouldn't look good with like a, sh a skirt because this just looks silly unless I put pants on. <laughs> Shall I do these? Hmm. Guess we're doing the cargo pants. I wish this was more like, maybe if I unbutton the bottom part. Yeah, that's better. Actually, I hate that. That's really disgusting. That's really, <laughs> that's really gross. I hate this. I'm gonna change the shirt that's underneath. I have one more shirt option. <laughs> oh my lord, <laughs> so bad. Okay, finally a shirt option that isn't horrendous. <laughs> and it also has a collar to poke out the top because that's the whole point of changing three times to get the look. Yeah, I actually kind of like this. I cropped this shirt by myself. That's why it looks a little um, not straight. <laughs> For shoes, let's do my docks. Where did they go? You know, imagine if I was that type of girl that wore heels with jeans. Like if I wasn't wearing cargo jeans, I feel like that'd be a look, but I don't have heels. The Oxfords will have to do. This isn't my favorite, but it still does slay quite a bit. I feel like this will look good with like pigtail braids. Yeah, that would be so good with this outfit. Lucan thrifted this. I also thrifted these, but these are actually from Urban Outfitters. Isn't that crazy? And then obviously these, and that's out of five. through this quick but let's do this first I've always wanted a scarf I don't really know how to wear scarves I think you do it I don't know like is it normal to <laughs> do it like that I could go with this fit if I really wanted it to I don't know why it kind of reminds me of Harry, po <laughs> Harry Potter I kind of like that I have free range with this because all I have is an accessory so I could just do whatever I want with the rest this could go in so many different directions it's making my brain hurt it's too late for this. <laughs> kinda wanna try pattern mixing. Hence, why we're gonna attempt to style it with this, I think. Yes, we're gonna try to style it with this. Getting out of my comfort zone. This outfit right now is kinda bad. <laughs> it's a lot. We're gonna just have, I'm gonna put a shirt. I actually don't really know what I'm doing. <laughs> my brain is drawing a blank here not gonna lie I can't tell if this is working or not because it doesn't really seem like it is this is not giving whatsoever the pattern mixing was not a good idea I'd say the top half is good the bottom half I think is the problem I really want to wear my black leg warmers so I think I'm gonna do a skirt <laughs> I, I don't know what's wrong you know what we're just gonna keep going we're gonna run with this guys I look like an internet girl. <laughs> like, you know those internet girls that look good in anything they put on their body? I mean, I can't get, I don't think I look good though. Cause this is not really giving what I wanted it to give. We're still gonna put on the leg warmers. Who is she? Who is she? Like, who is this person that I'm looking at right now? Cause it does not look like me. What is going on? They decided no leg warmers. I like the little leg peeking out. Okay, this actually isn't that bad. This is actually pretty good. This isn't that bad. It's, I think it's the long skirt because I don't wear them that often. But I have it and I need to wear it. So I kind of think it's it's pretty good. It's a little out of my comfort zone, but that's what these videos are about, right? I don't look like a real person right now. Lucan, thrifted, garage, thrifted. Obviously I got these from Prince Polly earlier. Outfit six, we got one more. thing we have are arm warmers you know we like to warm everything our legs our arms and our neck 
they're like a grayish color. They kind of like this. I actually really like them. I feel like this would go good with like a graphic tee. Like maybe a, like an oversized graphic tee. Ew. I'm like low key sweating right now, guys. The things I do. Got this shirt. Let's try this one. I don't know how to feel about the arm warmers. Hmm. Oh wait, they have, they have holes. <laughs> that explains things. These are making my arms so warm right now. I am like dying a little. I changed my mind. <laughs> yeah, top half, good. Bottom half, not good. It's definitely a pants moment, we need pants. Wait, I have the perfect pants. I would say this outfit is interesting. It's interesting. <laughs> Imagine half up, half down pigtails. Pretend that's in my hair, because I don't want to do that right now. Yeah, I don't really know how I feel about this one, but we're just going to go with it. The real question is, Converse or my docs? I am going to go with my Converse, because it makes it more casual. Yeah, this is very, very, very interesting. Here, we'll add a bag. Maybe it will make it better. Like a, a crossbody bag. That made it a little better. That definitely helped. All right, so final fit. I thrifted these and drew on them myself, actually. And then I got this from H&M. Yes, style. Look in. Last outfit, yay. to show you it it is a necklace and it has the Chinese character of love on it I'm pretty sure this is the Chinese character for love I did take Chinese I'm also adopted so I'm not sure tell me what you guys think. I'm pretty sure it is the Chinese character for love because that's the reason why I got it but it's in silver I'll try it on for you guys I'm like sweating right now holy moly look at how pretty it is it's so dainty you can get this in like silver or gold too I hope I'm not, like, saying that the character's wrong, because I'm pretty sure. Look how cute. It's so cute. I could, like, stack it with, like, other jewelry I have, too. Thank you guys so much for watching this video. And also, thank you to Lucan for sponsoring. Please go check them out. Their shipping is so fast, which I really appreciate. And all their stuff is so cute. Use my code, too. Let me know what you guys buy. I love you so much. If you like this video, like it. And if you like me, subscribe to my channel. I promise I won't be sick next time. Hopefully. I love you. Bye.